842. In 842 RG, an Ultima bomb, powerful enough to obliterate an entire continent, was dropped on the Black Peristilium in Lorica. In the blink of an eye, the Lorican Alliance, which had stood proud for 700 years, was completely erased from the common Orients. Wow. Enter class zero trophy. Saving progress? Yes. Alright. And hold on just one second. I'm gonna... Okay. Basically, it's still downloading. That's what I was trying to look for, is whether or not the... Final Fantasy 15 was still going or not. Ray, Ray, the Vermilion the Vermilion Banner. Banner. Chapter 2. A42. Fearing, Fearing an, an attack, attack with, with a second, second Ultima, Ultima bomb, the, the Kingdom of Concordia, Concordia, home to the Azure Peristilium, began yeah. defending the airspace over its territory and that of the Dominion of Rubrum. Concerned the war might spread to other nations, Concordia sought an immediate cessation of hostilities, but was rejected outright by the Dominion of Rubrum. With, With large, large portions, portions of, land of land occupied, occupied by the by Empire, Empire, the Dominion was reluctant to accept a ceasefire, as that would be a silent concession to the Empire's act of aggression. The Consortium of Eight, Rubrum's Supreme Ruling Council, spent several days debating how to recover their lost territory. Just putting some stuff up real quick. With our, With our forces, forces current, current state, state, do you, do you really, really believe we can defeat the Empire in a full-scale conflict? We we'll have to abandon our outer territories and focus on defending the capital and retaking key strategic areas. Oh, really? We can make up for our disadvantage in numbers with the sea. The Empire already unleashed in the sea on us during this invasion. We're lucky that it wasn't a Primus. If they want to throw dirt at us, I say we just throw it right back at them. Hmm. My, you quite the sense of humor. Do you really think a Lassie would accede to the wishes of the Consortium? Why not? The Vermilion Bird Crystal was attacked by an enemy Lassie. It was put in danger. There's no way that it's Lassie could refuse to aid us in this situation. And if the Lassie operated by that magic, you might actually have a point. Only the Vermilion Bird Crystal has the power to direct the Lassie to help us. And the wills or wants surrounding that do not a productive discussion make. Might I offer a suggestion? What kind of suggestion are you offering? The cadets who were involved in the liberation of the capital were unaffected by the jammer and managed to repel the White Tiger Lassie. Can we create more soldiers with the same magic technology used to create them? Huh. So create more fighters like Type Zero is what she's suggesting. Disclosure is out of the question. Haha. Ha. Dr. Alicia, have you have learned, learned anything, anything about, about the crystal the jammer? Very little, little, I'm afraid. I can say with certainty, though, that no human could operate the jammer. It would take a lessee. 
However, my scanners haven't detected any major disruptions since Lorica's little disappearing act. Based on the data, I believe that something has happened to the Lassie, and the jammer is inoperable. Even if that's true, do you have an actual plan to get us out of this current mess? Maybe. Just deploy the cadets. There you go. I believe that is the best way to turn the tide of battle without compromising our defenses. Undeniably, the Octo Cadets would make for a potent implement of war, but... Me guys are just children. Seems an expansion of the role of those defending the Peristyle? Ow! Oh. If the sea won't help us, what choice do we have? Very well. Shall we defer to the Chancellor's judgment? The Dominion's very existence is in peril. Each of us will be put to trial. Even the Agito Cadets. If Rubrum is at stake, they would welcome those challenges. Hmm. Very, Very well. well, then. Shall we, Shall make, we it? make it official? So it looks like we're part of war now. We are soldiers. Ready. Fountain Courtyard. Do you hear this music? Do you hear this classic Final Fantasy music? Oh my god. Ah, oh, the music. It is so pretty sounding. It is Final Fantasy, and every now and then you can actually hear during the fights, you hear the do 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 the victory theme. It's like, yes! It's so awesome. Is it true that Class Zero was able to withstand the influence of the Crystal Jammer? Maybe. All right, there's my character, Ace. So right now it's just Ace uh, doing his thing. A friend told me that Lucy from the invasion was a Secundus. Apparently she had the ability to enhance the power of any weapon, like those MAs. Wow, I didn't believe the rumors about crimson clad cadets thrashing the white tiger of the sea, but here you are, class zero of the flesh. I'm Aki from class first. It's an honor. Why don't we why don't I show you around? This is Academia, home of the Vermilion Peristylium. Your homeroom should be just through the entrance and down the hall to the left. You haven't met with your CO yet, have you? You won't be officially registered as a cadet until you do, so I would head there first. Our privileges to come with plenty of responsibilities, too. So we cadets are all here to look out for each other. So don't be a stranger. Okay. So options. Oh, there's my map right there on the side. Okay. It's actually interesting how they did the map. Is there a store... Not quite sure. Hey, it's a Moogle! Hi, Moogle! I don't believe we met before, Koopo. I'm Moogle in charge of class first. Let's see how the inside looks, the interior. That looks really cool. And it looks so much better on my TV than it does on YouTube because of the extra little de nuanced details. It's like, yes! 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 Okay. Alright, so... Where are we at? Or where are we going, per se? Classroom 11, oh, okay, classroom 9 and 10th. So I must be going this way, right? Turn around. This way. What's this? 7th and 8th, so I believe she said through the door? I thought all those times I went out hunting, mo hunting monsters would prepare me for combat, but I was wrong. Already, even though the fighting style is different, 
this feels like a Final Fantasy game already. And that's nice. And that's the thing I didn't really like too much about 12, but like, it didn't really feel... Part of the reason why I didn't like it was the battle system, but also too, I don't know why, but it felt like it wasn't, mu wasn't much of a Final Fantasy game. But this, to me, feels like a Final Fantasy game, as well as uh, Realm Reborn. Apparently, the Militesi Emperor just had up advantage one day. I suspect a foul play. No one can use ma weapons or magics. Tempest Phoenix seems to be the new buzzword around academia lately. Do you think it really means Orient is... Maybe? No way! I'd like to have a save point right now. Oh, there's our doctor here. There you are, Ace. I've been waiting for you, darling. Before you officially register as a cadet, there's something your mother would like to know. I have to warn you that two new cadets will be joining your dears in Class Zero. It may don the same crimson capes, but don't be fooled. They are nothing like you. You've been doing an excellent job collecting Phantoma. Those two new kids will be assisting in the harvest, but they don't know what Phantoma is. And I prefer they be, if they remain unaware. Other than U12, only a handful of elite researchers are privy to information about Phantoma. You dears receive certain privileges because you're special. But those two more new ones are not. Our research is strictly confidential, and I would hate to have for any secrets to get out. So do you poor mother a favor and keep this information to yourself? You do that for me, won't you, darling? Mother? Either that really is her his mother somehow, or 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 because I really doubt his, his it's actually his mother. I'm thinking because she created them through the technology of magic for them to become like this. She might be considered a mother kind of person. Like, the Powerpuff Girls is a uh, professor, is their father. Aha! Alright. And I will be right back. I am back, sorry about that. All right, so let's continue onward and meet our CO. All you tuned to Clay. So pretty much a, a summary of what she already told me. Classroom Zero. So I wonder if we can meet the other characters. What? what? Seven. So it begins our new life and a battle for the place we call our home. What? what? We're just sitting around around here for. Well, what are we just sitting around here for? I'm waiting for some matching, yo. I see boots. Right, right. Let's, Let's cut, cut through the formalities. I am now your commanding officer, Kurosame. Commanding Hi. officer? Yes. Hi, Kurosame. As of this moment, you are under my command. Okay. The authorization came directly from Arch Sorceress Oratia Alratia. 
From Mother? Hey. Take a hi, Theo. We only take orders from Mother. Got it? You're not wanted here, yo- <laughs> Oh! <laughs> I think there's a reason why he's your commanding officer. Not for long. He said it was mother's decision. Are you saying you won't follow mother's orders? Ouch. Satisfied. Good. Hold on one second. You will execute Dominion missions under my command. When you have no assignment. He will live here, at Academia, with the other cadets. On campus? Yes. We never had to do that before. Why start now? Does that come from Mother, too? Yes. Those are Dr. Horatio's orders. Hmm. Also, also Cadet Makina. Cadet Rep. Enter. You mean those two we met earlier in the game? Two new cadets have been assigned to Class Zero, starting today. Maki Nakunagiri. Hello. Ram Hi, Bryce. Kunin. Nice to meet you. Let me guess. Chaperones? Your time is yours until you receive further orders. I have high hopes for you. May the crystal guide you. Good to see you again. Thanks for the assist the other day. Ah, no problem, Makina. Thank you so much for helping us out. Seriously, though, I can't believe Class Zero is real. Why, my friends and I were no. sure yourselves were just one of Academy Yes, the game does come in English and Japanese. And it's so powerful. There's three of you took down all the sea. They said it would be good. Oh, it reminds me. Five after twelve. It's twelve thirty. Oh, my God. So... We're gonna go back. Yeah. Go back and see if they're open. All right. So six hours till the next mission. Um, we're gonna talk to some of the characters here. First, talk to the Moogle. Okay. What is it? Ordinarily, conjurers have to give their lives in order to summon idolans. But special idolans don't require any sacrifice of the sort. What a relief. I wonder what special idolins would be considered. What? what? Never went to a classroom when I went here. When I came here with Mother. So this is what they look like. Yes, King. Alright, let's talk to the Moogle. Starting today, I'll be relaying mission information and instructions from the Dominion. I am a military operation, organization, and guidance logistics expert. Moogle for short, Kubel. That works. I'll just stick with Moogle. Some military operation guy. Or mom, Kubel. You can Which call me whatever me? you want. I hope to be of service, Kubel. Thank you, Mog. Whatever I want? How about... Mog? Yeah, I just started playing just a little bit ago. Who's it with Bog? That's too high. Modlin's good enough. Yeah. Good enough? Just what the hell kind of name is that? No! Get to the cemetery. Head out that door over there and head and through the rear garden, Kubo. Many brave men and women gave their lives for us in the liberation. You should they offer them a prayer of thanks, Kubo. After all, you can't start thinking about the future until you pay homage to the past, Kubo. That's why I call it a bad day. Oh, info. Hi 
What? Sorry, I couldn't hear you. What? Are a shy one, aren't you? Am I going the right way? Yeah, I'm going the right way. Uh -huh. So, what the hell was up with that feathered freak we ran into during the liberation? I'm busy. Please, please, please make it quick. quick. What an orient to sit out of steam thinking. I thought his crystal jammer was heinous enough, but the Ultima Bomb is simply unexcusable. bad for her because it's like really okay fine what, what is, is this place, place? It's, it's called a cemetery. cemetery what's a cemetery are you serious here we call the names of the fallen so their legacies may live on because, because we, are we are unable, unable to retain memories, memories of those who died before us but i, but I heard that the crystal, crystal removes, removes our memories, memories to help us so that the living will be tied down to the dead that's, That's why, why we leave our knowing no tech behind before we go to battle. As proof that we live. If, if no one no comes, comes to pick up attack, it means that person died. Then that name is engraved here. As the name of someone who died for the Vermilion Bird. I always make sure to write down the names of everyone that I meet. Or go out on a mission with. Then after a mission, I check to see if there are any names I don't recognize. If there are names there that I don't remember, then I come here and look for the people I once knew. But I still can't remember them. I know, that doesn't seem like it's very fair for them to uh, remove memories like that. Yeah, they just passed through here. They're probably visiting someone's grave at the moment. Or, yeah, I'm wondering who's. Some events at Academia can be only triggered by using certain characters. Change active members to at Relic Terminals. So, I'm guessing that I gotta switch out to another character. Kupo. Have you finished offering your prayers, Kupo? Then let's learn how things work here at Academia, Kubo. On mission day, Central Command will issue sortie orders, and you'll be able to and you'll be on your way, Kubo. Until then though, you can use your free time to talk to whomever and go wherever you please, Kubo. You have 12 hours of free time in one day. Pay attention to the characters and the fallen icons. The vermilion bird, necessary for proceeding further in the game. Explanation point. Initiates an event, but, but uses two hours of free time. Ow. Okay. Question mark offers tutorials and hits for proceeding further in the game. Info provides a particular service, like selling items. When Mr. Day arrives, your CEO will call you in, Kubo. Then he'll explain your orders. And you'll march off into battle, Kubo. When you when you're just itching to start up your mission, go find Takinami in the Central Command, Kubo. I'm sure he'd be more than happy to keep, happy to help, so talk to him, and he'll get you ready to march right away, Kubo. You can also just confirm your next sortie orders, Kubo. That way, you know the difficulty level of your next mission, Kubo. If you don't think you're strong enough yet, keep training your head hard into the mission day, Kubo. You won't learn anything in academia if you don't know your way around, Kubo. Now that you're officially registered as a cadet, you're free to use the great portal in the entrance, Kubo. So go on and have a look around, Kubo. I have a special present for you once you explore all of Academia, Kubo. And don't be shy about chatting with the other cadets, Kubo. I've got another gift for you once you use, see a lot of explanation events, Kubo. I just know you'll love it here at Academia, Kubo. Moglin is a cute character. That's because Boogles are adorable. I went the wrong way, didn't I? That's right, I have to go up, I think. Yeah, that's right. Go this way. <coughs> I 
Okay, so something could happen. <clears throat> what? 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 A save so point. <clears throat> <clears throat> a save point, in other words. An artifact shrouded in mystery, said to be born of the vermilion bird crystal. I've heard it has the power to manipulate time and space. That's according to some legends, Kupao. In the Dominion, we sync them with magic and use them for data input and communication, Kupao. You can save your data. And such, Kupao. Save points, yay! Mistaken, cadets can do all of that with the naturally occurring relics all over the world. That's right, Kupao. If you find them, you should check it out, Kupao. All right, so let's do assignment. Okay, cool. Uh Ah. That's how it works. You're definitely playing this in Japanese, huh? So basically after this, I only have four hours of free time, I think is what they're doing now. Big brother. Big brother. I'm, I'm, in I'm in class, class zero, zero now. The legendary, the legendary class, class zero. zero. I was, I was reporting, reporting to my, to my brother. brother. Not, Not that, that I have any memories. memories. Of what he was Because they erased your memories. But it's weird. What is? According, According to, the to the records, records he wasn't was part of the Capital Liberation Campaign. The authorities wouldn't tell me anything. He was on the battlefield? Without, Without being deployed? deployed? That. Or he was on a top secret mission that they couldn't keep on record. He's your brother, Makina. I'm sure whatever he was doing, he did his best. I'd like to think that. But... Why would he be on the front lines? Brother... Why did you die? Ooh, got an X potion. You're starting to get fit right in here in the academia, Kupo. Something, something, something. Got an elixir. Okay, with that done, got four hours of free time now. Now I gotta kind of look around and see what events I can do. I could probably just grind. That's probably what I probably will end up doing, maybe. Just going around, see what else there is. Oh, that must be the portal. Oh, you already met with your CO. Now I guess that means you're officially one of us now. In that case, why don't I show you around a little? That great, that great portal in the center connects all sorts of places. The lounge, the ready room, the terrace, Chocobo Ranch, the armory, sorcery. Oh, that reminds me. The doctor told me to let you know she's waiting for you in her office. Be sure to warp over there later, okay? That door leads to Dominion's Central Command. The officers will provide you with all you need to know about your upcoming operations. Over here, we have the Crystarium. Its walls are practically bursting with information. The jewel of the Crystarium's crown is the Ru Rubicus, located right near the entrance. It's an incredible anthology of records, dossiers, and all sorts of advice. If you ever find yourself at a loss, first try consulting the Rubicus. Or Robicus, however it's pronounced, I don't know. Seems legit. Yeah, it's legit enough. It's legit enough. Um, so I can warp there. But I'm just so curious. Is there anything else I can do? Or are they just not going to let me do anything until I visit her? <laughs> Okay. Um, 
Yeah, you know what? I think I will go on ahead and... Ooh. Okay. Might as well go on ahead and just visit the doctor. Hey, it's Mugo! Oh, that's right. Mugo from class first. Yes. Armory, sorcery, ready room, lounge. Let's go to armory. If I could, I'd play some uh, Final Fantasy XIV right now, if I could. Well, not right now, I'm playing Type-0. At ease, cadet. This is the Six Arms Lab, otherwise known as the Armory. We provide ourselves in being the exclusive developer and distributor of arms in the Dominion. Should you ever find yourself in need of equipment, don't hesitate to ask. Okay. Ah, it must be the seller. But how can I tell what's better? Okay, playing cards. Actually, equipment. I think I got another set. Yeah, I do. Where's my ice 59? Justify down by two, but I think I. Yeah. My thing will be okay, it'll be worth it. So, I'll use bronze bangle. Oh, I can even use I can use cure too. But I like using wall. So th so I can actually Ooh, she uses Cura. Okay. Works for me. Let's see the Terrace. So much prettiness. But I think the music helps. Okay, yeah. Aha! Another two hour conversation. Two hour conversation. Seems like. I'm always running around with you guys. guys. Hmm. We're in the same class at the same academy. Of course we see a lot of each other. Yeah, yeah I know, I but... Know. Actually, I had no idea that Rem was even in the Dominion. If only I had known you were here, Machina. I would have tried to get in touch with you. I would have. I can't believe we kept missing each other for two months. Two months? Did you actually knew each other before coming here? Rem and I? We're from the same village. We saw each other at a drill. I hadn't seen him for seven years. I knew it was you. You haven't changed. Look at you. I was surprised by how tall you'd gotten, Makina. When we were back in the village, you were shorter than I was. <sighs> yeah, yeah, like, like I, said, I said, you haven't changed. <laughs> Take high potion. Two hours remaining. So I could screw around for another two hours, try to talk to someone. Or... Do something else, I guess? Go to sorcery. Oh, hi, Kami. Who's that pretty girl? Do you want up? Oh, there you go, puppies. Ah, uh, see, I can do another two-hour conversation here and call it good. Um, okay, but all right. No, I don't think it's two hours real time. Special orders, okay.
Receive beneficial status effects by accepting SOs. Completing earns rewards, but the price of failure is death. What? I'm gonna save real quick. I don't I don't like how it says the pirate price of failing is death. I'm like, wait a minute, what? So I'm gonna save real quick. Actually I'm going to switch back to Ace. Oops. Save. There we go. Saving the game. Still, it is my dream someday to voice act in a Final Fantasy or Tales game or a Persona game. It is my dream to achieve that someday. It doesn't make me feel any better, Jim Hans. Well, you're in the army now. If you suck, then you've been seen too much and you need to be taken care of. That does not make me feel any better about that. So let's try it. I don't know what's gonna happen, but let's talk to her. Okay. I'm sure you've been wondering why the 12 of you were unaffected by the Crystal Jammer. After all, the rest of the Dominion was completely helpless in the face of the device. You see, the Empire's Jammer suppressed the Vermilion Bird Crystal, the source of Rubrum's magic. So by cutting off access to their lone lifeline, the Legions were left utterly powerless. You children, however, are special. You derive your power from a different source. From where you ask? Why, from your dear mother's love, of course. In any case, you darlings have abso absolutely nothing to worry about as long as I'm here. Do your best and remember that I'm always watching over you. Stand for, or so I'm told. Okay. Mission day. Let's see how badly I'm gonna suck on from this mission now. Yes, I really like Tales games, and as I said, I, someday if I ever become a voice actor, I want to do Tales, Final Fantasy, and Persona because it looks just awesome. All right. Hey. Uh, I'm gonna die. What the? What? What? No, 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 no. Do you see that? What is a Tomberry doing in this classroom? Why, why is there a Tomberry? I hate Tomberries. At ease. At ease. You received your first marching orders from Central Command. Don't make that face. Your fellow cadets will be here there to provide backup if you need it. Activate backup settings to receipt report from Academia to reduce the damage allies take. However, to support personnel casualties will be tally as part of your mission grade. There's no shame in calling for backup if it needs you to complete your objective. The mission is as follows. After the virtual annihilation of his forces and the Imperial invasion, Red Rome decides to con conscript cadets into the military and send them to battle. The Dominion forms an elite unit of cadets who will recapture Matei, located on the outskirts of Academia. 
Cetra Command selects Class Zero to be part of the operation, marking their first time experiencing real battle. Proceed through the main gate and toward your destination. Once you complete your objective, return directly to Academia. I expect great things of you. Don't disappoint me. May the crystal guide you. Dismissed. So that's just pretty much me having to leave. Oh, okay. So that's it. Yeah. So I'm gonna save real quick again because I'm a spastic saver. Well, I just try to be as spastic as I can because I don't want to die. And I'm gonna check again to see how the download's going. Oh, quite a bit of download needed so far for uh, 15. So I will be uh, right back in a sec. Let's go. Doobie doop 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 doop. Gonna kill some enemies. And hopefully not to fail because I hate failing games like this. Oh, okay, so he gets to go out the door and not leave it open for me. What an asshole. Thank you. I'm counting on me too. I'm counting on me too. Good luck. Thank you. But in theater, we'd say break a leg. I'm for you. Thank you. Good luck. Oh, there's a save point right here. Oh shit. Fuck the traveling. I'll just go and save right here. <laughs> All right. This is your first sortie as Class Zero. Good luck, Koopo. You gain lots of experience in the field, but only if you participate in combat, Koopo. Oh, and remember, if things turn grim, don't be afraid to abort the mission, Koopo. Even if the operation ends in failure, the experience will stay with you, Koopo. Cadets who participate in combat receive experience points and level up. Those who remain in the reserves throughout a mission will not earn EXP. However, some cadets perform better than others depending on the circumstances. Prepare for anything by training all your cadets evenly, and utilize their unique strengths to gain the upper hand in battle. Adjust your squad formation at relic terminals mid-mission, and deploy your reserves, or replace your complete missions from missions on the title screen to train other cadets. Cadets not currently participating in combat remain on standby in the reserves. Those who stay in reserve squad throughout the mission will not earn EXP or level up. You can adjust your active squad formation at relic terminals. However, when one of your active members falls in battle, press up to replace him with or her with cadet run reserves, losing all cadets where it gets all in a game over. Certain squad formations grant active members prime status at the start of missions. These cadets achieve aura and trance status and take less damage. Aborting the mission will send the squad back to academia and allow them to keep all their EXP earned. If all members die in battle, they will lose all EXP and restart from the last save point. All HP and MP will be restored after each battle in the World of Orients. Immediately return to Academia at any time by accessing the field menu. Can I move now? Yes. So reserves. Okay. I kind of see what's going on, sort of. Yes. school. I like it. Oh my god! I feel so old school right now. I feel so amazing. I am feeling so amazing. Oh my god. I the, the, the younger Scotty in me is getting with and with uh
After you win an encounter, more enemies might attack your squad. So like fight or engage to engage or retreat to run away. Fight, of course. Bring it! Okay, time for me to kind of just... Nope! Fuck you! Victory! Nope, 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 nope. Whoa, okay. That was not expecting. Eat fruit, bitch! Oh, maybe not. Ah, I'm hearing the victory theme now. And it sounds so pretty. So to you. I got this. So you. I'm ready. Leave this to me. Oh, uh, one more fight should do it. Hi, Robert. Okay, um, so that means why. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's retreat. Let's head back so all of our characters can heal up real quick. But, okay, so I kind of got the idea how battle's gonna work in this. New entry has been added to Robicus. Okay. So, theoretically, everyone should be alive right now. And everyone's alive right now. Good. So, I'm starting to get the idea of how this works. Let's go to this first area here, because I'm assuming that's where we need to go. Yep, after the virtual annihilation of the forces, blah blah blah, we already know, begin mission. Select party members. So, I'm gonna start with Ace, and then we're gonna have... Queen. Um... And let's go with Scythe. Scythe. And then... There we go. Change equipment? No. And I will be the active with him. Reserves will be... Okay, the... Queen and Scythe is what I wanted. There we go. Select accept to receive backup from cadets and other comrades. Yes. I mean, I'm just starting now, so I'm probably going to suck in this game anyways. Select the board mission from the field menu to abort the campaign. You will lose all items, phantom, and SPP obtained, but retain all experience and AP. Yeah. 
Incoming. Take back our city from the Empire. Oh, I got a message. But why do I have a message? How do I achieve a message? Keep heading north, Kubo. Okay. There we go. KMP. Huh. Why is he like that? Town's defenses have begun to... Diversionary tactics, Kubo. While they distract the enemy, head west and circle around the Militesi base. Turrets, fucking auto turrets. I was not expecting that. All right, see you later. Okay, this way. I have to go this way. Right? No? This way then, maybe? this way anyways. Let's check it out. Incoming message. Auto kills. Those are always nice, auto kills. Boy taking damage, line. I see someone there. Ah, I think that's what we're missing. It's the auto turret right here. That's better. What are your members? Okay, it falls in battle. No, just no killing. Okay. 
Now, there we go. Now the wall is open that I couldn't reach before. Finally, I was getting worried there for a second. Oh, auto kills. You make life easy for me. Just slightly easy. see if there's anything else I need. Well, I see something over there. It looks like a healing spot. Healing board. Yep. Oops. I'm here, I'm here to help. Cool. Now, before I forget, let me ace this back alive. Okay. Not quite sure. Uh, thank you, I was going to say, better not get near me, sir, with your grenades and your shots. There we go. I prefer not using magic, personally, because I don't want to waste my MP. they do this? I can barely look. I can hardly bear to look. Koopa. Ah, oh, damn. That's, that's pretty bad. Ow, ow, come on. There you go. Dodge. Dodge, 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 dodge. Damn it, stop it. Come on, just go shoot missiles! Yay, we did it! 